I didn't sign a slip for that. Anything here? I don't know if it, I guess it's more just like the pressure. Okay. Yeah, I can't make that go away. I'm so sorry. No, I mean, it was just like the, a slight pressure that I could feel that it was there. Like, no, I can't feel any of that. Okay. I guess you gotta get it loose from the... I do, yeah. That's what I just did, yeah. One down. It looked like there was a lot that went down the sides. There was a lot. I thought they'd get my money's worth last time, is what you're saying. <laughs> I mean, I don't know why anyone tries to do this stuff if if they're not well, used to it, you know. I had a grandfather that would do it. I've heard yeah. that story well, before. My dad's told me stories of it before. They'd watch him do it. He would sit there and dig it out. I mean, you would watch the blood shoot out of it. And he would just, oh, goodness. That's the old school way. Yep. And, you know, a lot of people, if they couldn't get close to a doctor because they lived out in the country or something. That's how they had to do it. I mean, this other side is pretty far down. I don't know why it's not like it, but I'm glad you don't have more infection than you need. I guess we'll need a script for infection again. Nah, I think this will do it for you. You've had plenty and it hasn't really done anything, so. Mm -hmm. You're fine. <laughs> so I don't remove all of this soft tissue and here's why. You'll bleed like a stuck hog for days and days and days. So it will fall off, it will get better. Um, I need another three by three. 